where we met. So, definitely already a really striking color palette. The creator has said this pack was uh, like a dream core or weird core aesthetic. So, stick is win. I, hmm. Idle Fofo is sync. We don't want to idle there. So we can do what not rose is revert. That reverts objects back to their previous forms. Is that a stick? No, it's a, it's switching between a rose and a flower. And the yellow flower is hard to see on the yellow background. Okay, wait. But if I break it, there's a stick in there. Hold on. So then we need to make the rose revert statement around here instead. To be honest, it's kind of hard to read this text, but like at the top left, you can see that the objects are like transforming into different objects. And so if I set an object to revert, it's like going backwards in that transformation loop. So if I make this here, then I break it, then it'll become a stick now that's going forward in the transformations. The problem is that idle fofo is sync, it means that I need to like switch parity by like touching the wall. Wait, why, why is the stick push? What? No, no, no. No, base is push. How evil. How evil. That means that I have to go on top of this, doesn't it? <laughs> or, I like, I, I, I use the pushing to slowly move this object to the right. And so it can, so that I can touch a wall. Wow, why is this puzzle more, even more complicated than I expected? Let me switch parity again. Basically, I need to waste the turn in the correct turn. <laughs> Okay, there it is. Now it's against the wall. Okay, now I'm going to make that revert statement. Turning it back. And then I'm standing on the object. I I'm standing on the object I need to. But then I can just press right into the wall. So that instead of idling, which would cause me to sink, I don't idle there. Okay, this level pack is already like deceptively being tricky. Okay, so then we have more transformation loops in the middle. Which I hope is not that hard to see, because it's freaking- there's like white on yellow this time. I, I really enjoy the flavor though, because it's like the seed turns into a sprout, into a tree. In, like, seed, sprout, tree, trees. Then in, into just like husks, husk, rock. Then back into seed. It's a nice little progression there. But, the I do see that seed is push as well. So... I know I can't break the bog with a piece of text. Is there some object duplication I can do here? Because I know that I can very, very slowly push this into there. It's all near fungus's win, but I am not near the fungus right now. I am just barely not near it. If, however, if I could break this bog without losing myself, then yeah, that would be a win. Like if I go here and then do rock is seed, does that create more than one seed? It's hard to tell if that actually created anything else. But uh, if we assume that's object duplication, then we should be able to get m the, like, more than one unlock. Nope, that, that apparently did not duplicate anything. How about seed is rock? Would that make anything new? Hmm, I think it did. That's a rock stacked on top of everything. So, okay, the problem is now both objects that are on there need to, need to be pushed. Hmm. Oh, the, wait, yeah, the, this, this is great. Look at that. So that is, in fact, multiple rocks stacked on top of each other. I mean, the basic thing is that seed is sprout and seed is rock happen at the same time, which allowed an object duplication there. So there we go. Wait, there's two, there's two level threes. <laughs> I've, I have not seen that meme yet. Hmm. So Fofo is not, what, what is win then? Flag is win on the top right? Okay. But how do we get flag? Hmm. I can do like Fofo is move to move two squares at once, but this is not enough to get over. Is the flag freaking blending in on the right? Hold on. <laughs> no, I don't think there's a flag on the right. But you can probably get access to the text flag. Top left also says not idle Fofo is you, which means this also interacts with the bog is defeat because defeat only cares about objects that are you. So if I just idle, okay, I can move over this without worrying at all. But as long as I'm moving, of course. So how do I make another object here? How about on the top right, we could do like Fofo is rock and flag, and then rock is revert. So the rock will revert back into a Fofo. That looks good, right? And honestly, at this point, I don't really know why you wouldn't just... Like, you can move text over pretty much freely. Now that we know, like, since I found the freaking move tech. There you go. Hey. Okay. Nope, nope, not yet. 
If it was rock and flag and set up the revert. There we go. Rock is revert, uh, so that rock will turn back into Fuffle the next turn we win. There we go. So, what's the other level three? So we have flowers that are turning into roses and then back into yellow blending into the background flowers. This vine is also pushable. Hmm. Not sure what that did for us. We have back, which allows a character to move back in terms of like physical movement. So to win, we need to get rid of the flowers and the roses. Both of them. But I cannot target F Fofo with my statements. Flower eat rose. Like, okay, so the flowers are pushable, I guess. All is pushed, so that doesn't actually mean anything, huh? That's why the vines are pushed. They don't have any special meaning, really. Okay, but, but transformation with back is also really a strange idea. Like, what happens if I do flowers back? They, I don't think there, any of them are even going to move back. For they transform back, but they don't move back. Curse. Yeah, freaking... Back works with transform, but also with movement. It's just like, I guess the movement didn't really apply there, though, considering they were transforming all the time. We probably want to break this statement, but as Rose on Road is eat level, I actually want the distribution to be two flowers instead. Of course, these flowers are not easy to see, but you know, that's how things go. And I want to stack a flower on a rose somehow. I'm not sure how to do that. Like, we just do roses back. And will it move onto the flower is what I'm hoping it does. Okay. Then I, like, I do that. Now flower eats rose. So now, no, 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 the other way around. We need to have two objects that are different. Like rose eat flower. Now, once again, I do the same thing and then stack them. So then rose is, well, no, 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 rose is back. And then it will stack on the flower. Eventually, there we go. But now we turn the rose into a flower. Whoops, no, no, no. Rose is flower. Then flower eat flower. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> flower eat flower. This is too... There we go. So the, the flowers ate themselves, and remember the win condition was to remove all of the flowers and roses from the level, and we did that. Okay, now this is level 5. What is this, Fibonacci time? Okay. Seed right revert. Okay, so it turns into the text revert after some time. Okay, so Fofo unlocks this dust. It was like Seed was not supposed to write revert. It was like we should have interrupted it. Yeah, like that. And then do Seed as revert, but then again... Hmm... Can I push any of these? I don't think so. Now, this time we have the right keyword. Which does mean I could try text right push, but, uh... Let's not turn the entire thing into a push. Still, this means that there's some maybe duplication we're doing again, but this time with text, which is a little more volatile. Maybe do seed as revert, but also seed right push. This can this should probably cause some object duplication, or it freaking doesn't at all. <laughs> hmm. or like, what text is revert? I guess that doesn't seem to really help. Like the object does not come back. Like if I do that, it's like nothing is gonna come back afterwards. But it's actually way more st straightforward. There's something I can do. Boom. That's duplication, and that's also reversible duplication. If I do text as revert, um, <laughs> uh, th um, well, that better be more than one seed <laughs> when it comes to that moment, okay? Okay, it is more than one seed, which means that I can like fully clear this if I do this loop another time. Okay, do it again. Text is revert, and now seed is push. So that should be really four seeds on top of each other. Then we go here, and then boom, we win. Okay. I believe this pack was made for a theme called Branching Paths, which, like, sort of explains the map meme, but I'm not fully getting it, I guess. Like, I'm not even in control a small amount of the time. Because Fofo without star is you. I mean, this is kind of weird, because all the rules are locked besides this revert rule. So when I do dust as revert, I don't have time to really turn that, uh, to move this and turn something else into the revert. They're also in a four cycle. Both of these, like, objects are in a four cycle loop, and the flag is always on the same turn the dust is, which is not good, because we want to be on that flag without the dust, because that's the win condition. Hold on, but, but I could make the dust not revert on the same cycle? Like, what's going on with that? I thought that's something I would be able to make happen. Yeah, now the flag is not on the same cycle as the dust. Okay, that was it. All I need to do 
was get rid of the Dust's Revert and then put it back at a time when the flag was on a different cycle. Flower language. Oh, great. Welcome back. So, we need a flag and a tree in the level. Clearly, we need some object duplication then, because we can't do this without... Uh, hmm. Without coming up with a way to make two objects, but how? We're just gonna try curse things until it happens? And when's Sprout coming back? We had Sprout all the way back at the start of the level, but we can't make it happen again. Um, I don't know why. Feels like I should be able to, like, do that and... I don't know, the sprout, like, it's just too suspicious the sprout is involved. But maybe sprout should be tree instead. See, like, this really, it's like a timeline feature, so we can see where the sprout is. Like, I don't freaking know if the sprout's back in time. Okay, if, if I get rid of tree is back, it still creates a sprout in the three cycle. Now, every time that there's a sprout in the level, like, don't have control so but like the only way to have a flag and a tree means again we need object duplication and then we need sprout as tree which creates an infinite loop at some point where there's always a flag and a sprout in the level which i cannot actually allow because i'm not actually there <laughs> to to enjoy the winning properties so do we have like time to get rid of the word revert oh hmm that's created two trees, but not much else that's good. I mean, you can replace it with trees back. Oh, that is very interesting. There is a time in the past where there was a flag and a tree. Well, let's undo. There we go. <laughs> and then afterwards, the freaking sprout comes. Whoop doop doop. All right, once again, there might be no level nine, but no music. Sure. Never mind, yes there is. Anyway, flag is win. How to get rid of the ice? Uh, pff, the wind, I mean. The wind not on hedge is the feat. Yes, it's impossible to see the word hedge there. So I just need a hedge on top of the wind, and then it'll no longer be defeat. Seems suspiciously easy. I mean, okay, one thing is that the hedge is a solid thing, isn't it? So if I do that... Yeah, it, it's... Hedges stop. And if I do hedges back... I'm pretty sure it will move back, but that's not quite what we're going for. And eventually turn back into ice or something? And then the back cue will quit, and then it's just gonna alternate between the ice that was at the start of level, and then undoing. I'm not sure that transformation is really an effective thing at all, but it is a little suspicious that I'm able to push this one more. Like, I can do that, then do hedges back. So does that mean that the hedge will be able to go? No, hold on. Undo, undo. Mm, no, no, no. Still, it requires me to step on the wind, and I can't step on the wind with the text in the way. But the text is what allowed me to push that that far in the first place. Mm. Because this is a troll level in disguise. Also, the cliff is flag thing. But we die at the exact time we would have made it happen. Okay. Are there other hedges in the level? Or, like, I can't push those. It's probably uh, hidden cliffs on them. Okay, I hate this backward. Like, I- sorry. I didn't do that intentionally. <laughs> okay, okay, I need to backtrack that because I just solved the level in complete silence without explaining anything by accident. I mean, obviously I attempted the whole clip as flag cheese, it didn't work. I believe I put this in here, then hedges back to get it back. Then, like, I undid hedges back, then put it back. And freaking, I've never thought about this interaction ever, because people don't like using this word in their levels. But you can back the back. Okay, sure. Cool custom word. It might as well be a custom word at this point, because the freaking main game, nor the DL, uh, nor New Adventures enjoys it that much. So now we have a... Okay, new aesthetic, of course. Hmm. We need to do an and win. That seems easy. Oh, but there's probably going to be stuff that's stopping us from making it very easy. Like, Fofo is blah and win. Ah, and it's going to be Fofo is... Yeah, so it's going to be Fofo is revert and win, and it's all of a sudden very bad because, like, 
We can't connect the and win to anything good, seemingly, unless we can do something about the transformation. He has in the week struck me as very suspicious. It makes me think that I'm supposed to create a new object that is just like Fofo. And if I do that, then all of a sudden it's going to be good because revert won't revert back to anything because it was newly created. But, you know, not created from transformation, but created from hazing a thing. So I guess the real question is, why isn't like Fofo is, has Fofo enough? Because then we can't connect Fofo is weak. We need to do Hedge is weak, I bet. Because so we don't have a third Fofo text to put up there, so... Okay, Hedge is weak. So the next question is, if I do Fofo is Hedge, is there a way to get, to get the Hedge to die? All this stop means that there's nothing that I can put myself on top of, I think. And for weak objects to die, no, we must either go into a wall or overlap something. Oh god, I just realized, like... Fofo is win might not be the only way. Like, it could be that, the, we, that we create a hedge out of nothing, and so it's another object duplication style level. Like, I can also do Fofo is hedge and hedge. Oh, wait, hmm. And that will create two hedges on the same square. So if we do hedges revert now... Spaghetti Monster Y. Mm. No, okay, it's it's because the that's not a fofo, it was always a hedge. The object was a hedge, always. It started as a hedge and revert always or tries to revert back to the very starting thing. And it started as a hedge, so that's what it reverts into. Hmm, so if I do it the other way around, of fofo and fofo is revert, it should be two times fofo is revert. I never knew if this was object duplication or not, if that actually worked. But uh, I guess we could see, we need to make hedges weak. And if this does create a dying hedge, no it doesn't, okay. If the hedge died, then object duplication would have worked. But, this is not it. Well, if I wanted to do object duplication, this is way easier. There we go. So, hold on. Oh my god, the awkwardness. But yeah, this is now a bunch of Fofos stacked on each other. I can tell you for sure because the particles are duplicated as well. So now, Fofo is weak will explode because there are multiple Fofos stacked. But I believe we still want to make hedges weak. So, Fofo has Fofo. Is revert. Creating a... Oh yeah, because because what needs to happen is... Hedge has Fofo, not Fofo has Fofo. Okay. Alright, so now that has created fo new Fofos that should not have a uh, Hedge counting as their starting form. And I'm pretty sure that solves the level because I can just do Fofo as Revert now without it turning back into a Hedge. There we go. Okay, I got exhausted playing with these mechanics and I'm not going to continue this. It's- it's- I, I don't solve the next two puzzles, the video is going to end abruptly. The creator even tried to resolve re one of the two and they said it was impossible, so chess battle advanced. Pretty good level, I think. Now diffuse. Oh, welcome back to this drab atmosphere. Rose is more and back. So some of the roses are going back to where they... I'm not even sure what what exactly back is doing here. <laughs> oh, oh, okay. There is actually a time when roses back will delete all of the created f uh, roses. So, hmm, what's? Hmm. So the only thing getting in, in our way is this grass and flag without roses wins. So we need to get rid of the rose completely. You know, I don't really know how much of a challenge this is going to be. It seems pretty straightforward that we're here to get rid of the center rose. I mean, we can't push it. We can't select the rose to be put on another. Yes, we can. Wait, what the hell? I was going to do Rose's hedge too, because that's allowed, right? Because, um, <laughs> rose eat all. So rose can, of course, eat other roses. We we're like, we already got rid of the center one. So just wait until they're all gone or something. I don't know. Never mind. Well, because I actually killed Fofo. Why do we need two Fofos? There we go. Oh, shoot. Grass is defeat. Why is grass still defeat? What have I done wrong? Ah, Rose, right. Rose eat all, so we probably use the Rose to... Alright, hold on. God. Edge has Cliff. Very funny. So I guess what, we need to Roses more here or something like that. Do we just, like, let this go here? <laughs> Pretty sure this will not work given the intuition about transformation steps, but yeah, Roses more and Hedge does not create a bunch of roses and a more step or something. It just doesn't. You know, I did notice something with the more and back thing. If you do roses back, there's something interesting, like, cause because the more objects overwrite the backiness, like you have this situation where there's holes where the roses are. And we're, we're going to need that, I think. Cause we need like a rose here without blocking anything. 
I mean, I know for a fact the rose needs to go there, but how to get this to work without the fofo ruining, uh, without killing the fofo, I have no freaking idea. <laughs> rose is more in back. We wait. See, that's created a hole. That's, like, really relevant. If only it could make it work more consistently. Maybe I... Oh my gosh, hold on. Push in back, move one of the roses. Now more in back with the Fofo in the top corner, please. Nope, no. Ugh. So much for getting a rose in that position. Okay, here is level 11, Immortality. Okay, we got- hey, look at that, we're back here. To this nice aesthetic. Okay, so tree is back in revert. We got we got a ton of rules here and um and uh okay please say okay all is stopped so I can't just focus his win so we need to break the vine of course there's like the lily pad stuff there is just like for art and so we need to find a way to break two things and win Fofo not without trees you therefore I need a tree in the level at all times so I can't even do tree is open because I'm no longer controlling anyone because <laughs> I don't have the tree in the level I think I'm lim hmm. I was gonna say I was limited to one thing is open, but I, it, maybe it's not. Still, I need to get an object back. Hmm. What's Revert doing here? Stick is back and open. And if I wait long enough, I don't actually think a stick is gonna come back. Fofo is back and open, there's also no strategy there. Like, if there's no magic Fofo come back, so... It really does feel like I must be doing some back plus revert shenanigans or something. I could do tree is fofo and stick and then somehow turn it back. I don't know. Seems actually impossible though, maybe. To have the tree be multiple things and then turn it back. If I do tree is back, it'll become a stick eventually. Yep. And if I time it on the same turn as the revert, does that create two trees or what? Or um, two sticks, I mean. See this? It doesn't. Hmm. Alright, I told you the video was gonna end up right.